Both Freepik and Canva are popular online design platforms, but they have served slightly different purposes and have unique features. Here is a detailed comparison of these two platforms to help you choose the one that suits your needs. First topic is Purpose. Freepik is primarily a platform for finding and downloading graphic resources like vector, illustrations, photos, icons and PSD files. It's a valuable resource for designers looking for assets to use in their projects. Canva. Canva is a versatile design tool that allows users to create a wide range of visual content, including social media graphics, presentations, posters and more. It's geared towards both design and beginners and professionals who want to create custom designs. Well, the second term is design capabilities. Freepik offers a vast library of pre-made design assets, but it doesn't have a built-in design editor. You need ad ad additional software like Adobe Illustrator or Photoshop to customize and edit the download assets. Canva provides an intuitive user-friendly design editor with drag and drop functionality. It allows users to create designs from scratch or customize templates with ease. Canva also offers a wide range of design elements and templates for various purposes. Third term is design templates. Freepik focuses on individual design assets. It may not offer as many pre-made templates for specific projects. Canva is known for its extensive library of professionally designed templates, covering everything from social media posts to business cards. These templates can save users a significant amount of time. Well, the fourth term is collaboration. Freepix primarily a resource for individual designers and it doesn't have a built-in collaboration features. Canva supports collaboration on design projects, making it a great choice for teams and businesses. Users can work together in real time, share designs and leave comments. Free versus paid. Well, Freepik offers free and premium content. Well, there is a free section. Access to the full range assets typically requires a premium subscription. Canva offers a free version with basic features and a paid subscription with Canva Pro that unlocks more advanced tools, templates and collaboration features. Well, the number six is learning curve. Using Freepik primarily involves searching and downloading assets. There is no learning curve if you're simply looking for resources. Canva Design Editor is designed to be user-friendly, making it accessible to beginners. However, it also has advanced features for experienced designers who want more control over their designs. Well, the last one, the last term, and then we go to the conclusion, is licensing. Well, assets from Freepik often come with specific licensing terms, so it's important to read and understand these terms, especially when using assets for commercial purposes. Keep that in mind. Canva licensing terms are generally more straightforward and they offer a one design use license for many elements, making it easier for users to, to uh, know how they can use their designs. Well, now, the conclusion between Freepik and Canva, if you're primarily looking for high quality design assets in your project, you uh, can choose Canva. Uh, you can choose free pick. I'm sorry if you're looking for high quality design assets in your project, but keep in mind you'll need additional software to, for customization. On the other hand, opt for Canva if you need a versatile all-in-one design platform with a user-friendly editor, a pre-made templates and collaboration features. Canva is ideal for creating custom design quickly and efficiently, whether you design novice or a professional. So leave in the comments what you think you will choose between Freepik and Canva. And uh, well, this was it. We come to an end of this comparison and see you in the next one. Thank you. Bye-bye.